One favorite thing as a bus enthusiast in Singapore is to settle the public bus routes. From an interesting landmark to the history, to its own uniqueness of certain bus services. While some bus services have a similarity, we will showcase them into a topic. If you like to adventure on public bus routes and get to know the history like me, you're in the right place. Welcome to Discovery Buses in Singapore! In this episode of Discovery Buses in Singapore, DMU will showcase issues two of its favorite pastime as BS Transit bus services. It all started with the two famous bus services in Ishun in the early days when SMRT buses is the 99% majority in the area. While we don't count service 103, those who live in Ishun are familiar with the bus service. First stop, service 39. To students and residents of Pasiris, service 39 is our best friend. Especially for those who work in Changi Cargo Complex via Service 89. Service 39 is the only bus service to ferry residents of Sembawang and issue to Pasiris. However, in 2021, the Rule Amendment of Service 39 to apply Pongo Central brings convenience to residents of Pongo for one direct alternative route to the Karti MRT. However, residents and students of Pasiris and Ishun disagreed with a good amendment as it will take an additional time of up to 20 minutes of journey. In the past, Service 39 is a favour to many bus enthusiasts thanks to the retired Volvo B10M buses and the image of SBS Transit in Ishun. Now with double deckers, Service 39 will cater to high demand sectors between Kartik and Pasiris via Pongol. The evolution of Service 39 has changed after its good amendment into Pongol. The last stop on the list is Service 85. Back in the day, there was two separate bus routes during the morning peak. The morning peak hour route played Sengkang East Road, while the amended route played Sengkang East and Jalan Kayu. Due to positive feedback, SBS Transit withdraws from the morning peak hour route in 2012 to bring more buses during the rush hour. Operated by Go Ahead, Many bus enthusiasts will remember the old times when Service 85 deployed Scanner KUB and Volvo BTM buses from the Haogang region. In late 2016, Service 85 was transiting into full fleet double deckers for the entire day, although the demand is slow to moderate during the off peak. However, Service 85 is the first bus service under Go Head to run at its fixed frequency of 70 buses during off peak and it is considered as the OTA. Residents of Sengkang East will rely on Service 85 to cut the MRT on weekdays. To bus enthusiasts in Ishun, Service 3985 is the first two bus services under the hands of SBS Transit. Eventually, in 2018, SBS Transit took over Ishun feeders, Services 850 Express, 851, 852, and 860. And it all started with Services 39 and 85. What are your memories on services 39 and 85? Leave your comment down below. That's for watching, and do leave a like, comment, and subscribe.